one of those questions again. Fasting during the pandemic is definitely not easy. Not only that, our body needs to adjust to this new eating habit for the next four weeks, but we also have to um, be cautious to avoid catching a dangerous disease. Then comes the burning question. Can fasting affect someone's chance of contracting a coronavirus? Some studies suggest that fasting, if done properly, can in fact improve our immune system. When we limit our calorie intake by fasting, this causes a mild stress on the cells of our body. That stress, though, can really boost the cells to work even more efficiently by forcing the body to actually eat the glucose and fat stores. As a result, these changes in the body cause stem cells to produce new cells in our immune system. Yeah. Puasa sebetulnya kalau dilihat itu banyak sekali meningkatkan imunitas ya. Karena kita biasanya makan ya kadang-kadang makan yang tidak teratur atau makan banyak gorengan, ya banyak yang berlemak-lemak, ya tidak diet ya. Jadi sembarangan ya, apa namanya seringkali yang terlalu banyak petsinnya. Ya dengan berpuasa kita lebih memilih makanan-makanan yang bergizi. Dan kita juga apa namanya uh, apa lambung juga diberi istirahat dikosongkan That's right. To achieve a regeneration, you have to make sure that you eat right. Sel-sel imunitas tubuh kita itu dibentuk dari struktur dasarnya protein. Nah, protein ini dapat kita penuhi dari makanan dan minuman, terutama adalah dari makanan yang berjenis lauk hewani dan lauk nabati. Dan kemudian dilengkapi dengan minuman yang berprotein seperti kita peroleh dari susu dan dari minuman fortifikasi yang mengandung protein. Pay attention on how you cook the protein. If possible, avoid adding coconut milk or deep frying because that can damage the protein. Oh, one last thing. Our immune system is linked to our sleeping pattern and also exercise. So if you usually stay up late, don't stay up late. And if you usually do a very rigorous exercise, try to switch something, you know, lighter maybe about 30 minutes before iftar, so your body will not get dehydrated. Sarah Mediana and Reza Nindita for today.